Guys, a little Clasher here, and welcome back to the Clash of Clans Let's Play. And today's a special episode uh, because we're actually gonna play our first war, clan war. So I prepared some troops. I'm I'm very very weak, as you can see, uh, but uh, <clears throat> I have a very nice base. I built it myself. I don't know if is it a common base that others build. But it's a very, very useful base, and as, uh, you can see that I've won like two defenses. Go ahead, uh, so we're gonna go ahead and attack. As you can see, we're, we're winning. We just made like four attacks, and we got 12 stars while they uh, had like six attacks. And the best thing is that they uh, didn't take any star from me. I'm gonna just fast forward it and see why that happened. So that happened because, uh, well, my clan mates, my the members of the clan, actually uh, put a minion and a Valkyrie at the clan castle as a defense, and it is a very useful unit, the Valkyrie, when you uh, when someone attacks you with ground units that are like giants, uh, archers. Barbarians, etc. So, as you can see, you know, number seven of the opponent clan just attacked, but he couldn't destroy me. He got like 22%. Yeah, 22%. Not a star. And I think this war is, uh, is won. So I'm going to go ahead and attack nine. Let's see if I uh, have the correct troops. All right, so I have a composition of six uh, giants. Uh, 10 Barbarians level 2 and 25 Archers level 2. So uh, I, uh, I saw the other members attacks and I can see that they don't have uh, clan any any troops in their clan castles. The friends games it's called their clan. So yeah. Attack number 9. Which is, uh, which is weak, you can say. And then we're just going to go, gonna go ahead and attack with the Barbarians. Let's go ahead and attack. I didn't get any troops from my me clan members, but it's because they are not so active. We're just a few, but we are a very friendly clan. As you can see, I, 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 uh, I just talked with them last the last day and... They were a very friendly clan, friendly people, nice people, most of all. So we're going to just go ahead and attack number 9. Let's see, does he have any troops? No, he doesn't have any troops in his clan castle, so I'm going to deploy like two archers and one barbarian there. We're going to just go ahead and attack all... I'm going to put all the giants at the mortar, and then we can attack the other defense buildings and we're just going to go ahead and round all his base with his archers so i think that uh, i will take like three three stars it looks like a very easy battle and as you can see i almost destroyed all his defenses it's great So we're just gonna wait for the for the end of this battle, and we got like three thousand uh, for each resource reward. So yeah, I think I'm gonna take like thirty three thousand uh, elixir and thirty three thousand gold after the war is done. Oh, I got like five thousand for each. So yeah, so my clan got got three stars. Uh, and we are ready for a next battle, which is great. But go ahead and make a, a farming uh, composition attack. So I'm going to do like 25 goblins, which I'm actually uh, uh, upgrading them to level 2, which is going to upgrade their damage per second, hit points, training cost, but not their training time, so yeah. Uh, 
and we are just going to put some archers and five barbarians so yeah that's great so i think i'm going to go ahead and let's just see uh, eight number eight oh it's a very well this is a hard one you know yeah just going to go ahead and uh, quickly attack number 10 which is very i mean very 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 easy because you know we're, we're just going to de deploy like three uh, giants there and just go ahead and overrun his base with barbarians from every side and see if he has some buildings yeah he doesn't have any buildings on the corner of the map that's great and after I win this battle, I'm, uh, I we're just gonna go ahead and watch some uh, of our uh, clan clan mates uh, attacks on the opponent's clan. So yeah, we're winning. That's a great thing. Um, yeah, as you can see, we actually won this one. Yeah, we got one hundred percent and two thousand per each resource, and thirteen and two hundred uh, legs and gold. So yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna get like a uh, a good loot after the war. So right now we're just going just going to go ahead and watch some of our friends attacks. Let's just see Mojo Jojo uh, 318 attack on number six. Let's go ahead and speed the attack. And as you can see, he has like uh, level four giants, level four wizards, and archers, and he has two level two healers, which is a great thing. And he even has a king level one. Is super great, and he. I think his base is gonna go out for in just forty seconds. We don't have much time, so we're gonna go ahead and speed up. And yeah, basically, he just destroyed the corner buildings. It was a great attack on El Diablo. So Mojojo three hundred eighteen. A great guy I've talked to him so let's see Mojojo again attack this guy I'm just gonna go ahead and speed up and this is a very easy attack I can say on number five actually number five was uh, even weaker than number six number six had like uh, stone and uh, uh, these level three balls so we're just gonna go ahead we can see that he wrecked that base. Let us go ahead and dot Clutch King. Sorry, Clutch King. Uh, he's a very nice guy. Uh, he gives troops. Very nice person. And we're just gonna fast forward and see his attack. Speed up and see the attack. So he attacked with the level one king. Uh, he uh, positioned the attack only at one side of the base. So uh, he uh, pressed the attack on this side of the base which you can see right here and it was a very thought of attack it's gonna speed up and you can see hog riders here that are uh, doing a great job on destroying the defenses it's a great thing so yeah we're just gonna go ahead and uh, skip that and we're just gonna go on number two and speed that up really quickly because we have only like 30 seconds time uh, so we're just going to go ahead and watch this. All right, so it is a very good number, uh, Town Hall 7 base. I can see that he is actually almost maxed out. Uh, very nice attack. He uh, even had Becca's level 3. And this guy is Magic. Magic Jester is the best uh, player on the on our clan. We have like 20, 20 members. I'm going to... And I'm going to just... Uh, end this episode guys and i hope that you have fun and have a nice day and stay ethical